Hi everyone. So in this quick fix tutorial, we're going to look at fixing a rat's nest. So I've got one of my second year students as a character here. And unfortunately, when we go to export it as an object file, we will very quickly see that it has a warning. One warning. And it says that there is a rat's nest in the mesh character. So that's this mesh here. It's got a rat's nest in it. Okay, so really quickly, what is a rat's nest? Well, in simple terms, a rat's nest is when you have done a very silly thing at one point whereby you have welded the vertice of an inverted polygon like this to a normal polygon. So you've got this kind of inconsistency. And you've probably got a load of loose vertices about as well somewhere. Basically, it's a total nightmare. Okay, now there's a couple of ways you could fix it. First way is to actually go in there and have a look at every single vertice and check that it's fine. That would, of course, take forever. Here's the quick fix. So, first thing we need to do is just look at the character mesh because it didn't say there was anything wrong with any of the other meshes, so I'm just going to hide them. Okay, now that character mesh selected, I'm going to go to the modify panel and I'm going to go to edit mesh, like so. So, in edit mesh, if I go on element and I select the entire element of the character like this, under surface properties, there's a unify button. So I'm just going to click that. Now, all that's going to do, that's going to unify all of these polygons so they're all facing the right way around. Okay, so that's the first thing. So I've now eliminated that problem. Now, that might alone fix it, but odds are um, it won't. So I'm going to convert it back to an editable poly. There is probably loose vertices in here somewhere. So what I'm also going to do is under editable poly is select the entire element and I'm going to go down to edit geometry and I'm going to go and click detach okay and I'm going to call this new character okay now in theory, because I've selected all of the uh, front-facing polygons on the outside of the mesh when I did that and detached them, the new character, all that's going to be left in the old character is all of the stuff I don't want. So basically all I do is just simply delete the old character. Now I'm left with this. This should be clean. Okay. Moment of truth. Let's test it out, see if it worked. So export object file and there you go no warnings all fine excellent so hope that helps you guys and catch you next time